Are you Quinn? Well, if it ain't the bloody Grim Reaper himself. What are you talking about? Christ almighty, lad. You got half the garrison shedding themselves and afraid you got on patrol. Look, I don't want no trouble. You hear? The commander said to help you. That's what I'll do. Just, just don't kill me, all right? I got children. Eat them. Well, I, look, I, I don't really have yet, but... All right, all right, I, I don't really have any. Just, just don't fucking shoot me. Relax. I'm not here to hurt you. Well, whether that's true or not, I'll take some comfort knowing there's three inches of bulletproof glass between us. Look, Keitner said you can help me. Can you? Yeah. She told me to be expecting you. I'm just glad you came as soon as you did instead of going off on your own. There's enough kegs of powder lying around here already without throwing another loose cannon in the mix. You know how much we're risking to keep you off the radar? We've only got so much pull around here. It's Burke's show. And he'll do as he bloody well pleases, which means stamping out any rats the moment he gets wind of them. I'm grateful, but can we get on with it? I understand you run a nice little sideline in procurement. Aye. From time to time you might say being inclined to do a little, uh, how should we call it? Bartering. On the side. Since the commander signed off on it, I suppose I could open my stock to you. For a price, that is. You mean I have to pay? What? Of course you have to bloody well pay. Ain't exactly a fucking army quartermaster down here. I'm just a savvy contractor trying to make ends meet. This ain't a bleeding charity. Considering the circumstances... Circumstances? What, that you're a fugitive and I'm risking my neck just talking to you? What are you trying to pull here? Although, I don't suppose you had anything to do with a stasis pod that was saved back on the ship. How do you know about that? Ah, so it was you, eh? Well, let's just say I have me sources and your little random act of kindness didn't go unnoticed. Tell you what, I'll give you a discount on me wares. Just no freebies or handouts. But now that I think of it, if you're looking for a little something for nothing and don't mind a little light work, I've got an errand that could use running. Consider it a special offer of sorts. Interested? All right, tell me about this special offer. Look, I don't know if you've noticed yet, but this base is packing some serious heat, especially in the form of those walking brick shit has boxcars. If you get me a few odds and ends, I might be able to whip up a little something to make getting around easier, if you catch my meaning. What kind of something are we talking about here? Nothing fancy. Just a 329 series NPRS. A rocket launcher? That's right, mate. And custom built. But yours truly, of course. You see, while I might be able to get my fingers on some low-level arms, I'm a little restricted when it comes to military-grade bells and whistles. And I'm itching to try out a new trigger propulsion mix. Maybe even recalibrate the guidance system for some extra punch. I like the sound of this. Fucking right, you like the sound of this? It's the bollocks. Look, all you gotta do is find me some components. I'll do the rest. An earlier boat had a shipment of 329s, but I wasn't able to poach any of them before they made it to the armory. Luckily, little Sparrow and my employee managed to lose one through maintenance circulation. But he got himself shit canned before I could collect. Now my little butte's lying around the base somewhere in bloody pieces. The launcher, I mean, not the wee man. Though, I have no idea what really happened to him. Right, so, long story short, you need me to find the parts and bring them back to you. Yeah, that about sums it up, I'd say. Just find me the trigger module, scope assembly, and launcher barrel, and we're in business. I could scrape up the rest from leftovers here in the shop. I think I already found one. Hey, let me see what you got there. That's the 329's trigger module. Let me know when you find the other two. What are you buying?
Satisfaction guaranteed. Unless, of course, you fuck it up yourself. So, what's the story? What exactly do you do here, Quinn? In a more civilized world, you might say I pass with the base's lead maintenance engineer. But if you look at it from Baltar's point of view, I might as well just be a glorified janitor. Pay's good though, so, you know, not complaining. If the pay's good, why the underground market? Well, why not? You see, civilian contractors operate under different jurisdiction when it comes to bringing outside goods into the base. So while the rank and file grunts can only order and receive essentials, toothpaste and the like, I, being the entrepreneurial chap that I am, offer a more uh, robust catalogue of goods and services. You know the sort. Smokes, beverages and uh, gentlemen's literature. How does this involve weapons? Now, now, let me finish. As an enterprising fellow, I require an exchange of valuables for these slightly less than essential supplies and often receive some very non-civilian contractor regulated equipment in exchange, if you catch me drift. Now, normally, I launder my stock through a contact on the mainland, but a deal in Shanghai recently fell through, so lucky for you, I've got some excess inventory to move. Consider this whole arrangement uh, a matter of fortunate timing. And Keitner is okay with all of this? Uh, not exactly. You see, some time ago, the commander got wind of my little operation down here. But before she could throw me in the brig, I offered her something I knew she couldn't refuse. Information. I ain't bragging, but uh, I'd managed to build myself quite a little network of sparrows and gophers. I'd known for a while that she'd been at odds with that prick Burke. In the end, I reached a rather simple mutual agreement. I keep her in the loop, and she keeps my neck out of the noose, so to speak. What can you tell me about this base? Nothing you don't know, probably. To the outside world, it's a Beltar Naval Logistics Headquarters and Supply Point for their Pacific operations. Beneath the surface, though, it's much, much more. How so? Look, nothing personal, mate, but I prefer the commander to most of the informing. As far as I'm concerned, the less I know, and more importantly, the less I say in this matter, the better off we all are. I gotta go. Right. Do us both a favor. Keep your head down.
over here! Access granted.
request granted. Access granted. Access granted.
Access granted. 